Hello guys, welcome you all in a new video and this video is totally dedicated for the consumers who is using Samsung Android smartphone of any series like A series, J series, M series or F series if you are using and if your Samsung Android smartphone is locked due to forgotten pin pattern and password lock then after hard reset and factory data reset of your handset when you will switch on your phone you will get a such type of display where you will get welcome pop-up language option start button and emergency call option okay now after the factory data reset when you will go through all the process with your screen let's check what happened to this phone go to the agree and agree from here one more thing I would like to connect, uh, show you that you will have to connect your phone to the Wi-Fi network. So you can see here I have already connected my phone to the Wi-Fi network. So make sure connect your phone to the Wi-Fi network. Now go to the next option after this. You will reach to a new page. Let's check the new page what's appearing on your phone. So here you can see uh, your phone was factory reset and it's again asking you to draw your pattern lock pin lock or password lock so here you can see you will get an another option that is showing here use my google account instead and when you will tap on this option you will switch to a new page and you can see here this page is of google verifying your account it means here you will have to feed your gmail id and password okay so if you have your gmail id and password remembered then you can easily feed your gmail id and password in this space and go to the next option but if you don't have your gmail id and password so you can see here you're not getting any skip option on this space so in this video i will show you how you can get a skip option in this space because without any skip option you can't go to the next page okay so this lock is generally uh, known as FRP lock which is generated by the Google you can see here. So in this video I will explain you how to bypass your FRP lock of your Samsung Android smartphone and for this you will have to firstly reach to the starting page like this. Now from this uh, page the starting page you will have to make some changes firstly you will have to change your language from English India to English US go to the next option now after that you will have to tap on this start option here and go agree to all and agree again here agree now in this space where the Wi-Fi network was asking from here you will have to activate your phone's talkback option and for this you will have to press the power button and the volume up button press hold and release here So here after that you have to tap on this use again you will have to repeat the same. Now in this space here you will have to draw a opposite L like this. Now after that you have to tap on this while using the app double tap. Now after that you have to double tap on this use voice command. open google assistant open setting now when your setting option will appear on your phone display you have to firstly switch off your talkback option otherwise it uh, uh, make you annoying to uh, make some changes in your setting page so firstly uh, switch off your talkback option so you can see here the talkback option has been switched off. Now some viewer says that your phone is not locked. So you can see here at the top corner of the phone the lock animation is showing. So this phone is uh, definitely locked due to uh, FRP lock. So in this space you have to make some changes. Firstly you will have to scroll down and come to the option that will show here uh, lock screen option and you will get the first option that is your uh, lock screen type you can see here it's showing here swipe but you can see it's not working here okay so don't worry in this space you don't have to worry here simply you have to scroll down and come to the option that will show here fingerprint option okay now when you will tap on this fingerprint option you will get a continue pop-up at the bottom of this page simply you have to tap on this the first time you will uh, when you will tap on this you can see here it's again ask you to continue 
so here you will have to tap on this continue option five time one two three four and five okay now after that simply you have to go to the back option in this space now after that here you will have to tap on this about lock screen option and you have to tap on this open source license now when you will come on this page you will get a uh, lots of text in this space but here you will get a url you can see here this is the url you have to copy this url from here Okay, now copy from here go to the back now after that it's nothing to make some more changes in your setting page so simply you have to exit from the setting page here okay now after that again you will have to come to the start again you have to start from here agree to all and agree here now go to the more and agree now here in this space again you have to come on this add network page and here you have to come on this setting page now when you will come on this setting page firstly you will have to scroll down and come to the option that will show here reset to default setting you have to tap on this and tap on this erase keyboard setting and erase from here now after that erase personalized prediction and erase go to the back now scroll up and come to the option that will show here language and types tap on this one go to the option that will show here manage input language now here you have to again change the language you have to switch on this english us and switch off from english india go to the back option here again you have to go to the back now after that you have to come to the option that will show here text shortcut tap on this one and you have to tap on this add option now in the first we're showing shortcut here you will have to type that as star has double zero then star and has and the second option you will have to paste that url which you had copied in the setting page go to the ok and go to the back option now the last change you have to do that is layout go to the button and symbol layout and change here from default to alternative and apply from here and ok now after that all the things has been done go to the back option here and again you have to reach to the starting page now my friend all the settings has been done after that let's check what happened to the frp lock page either it's unlocked or not so go to the start option again agree to all and agree go to the more and agree now tap on this next now choose this option that is don't copy So here you can see where the Gmail ID and password are asking. Uh, now you are getting here a skip option. Now you can easily skip this page because this page was very important to skip from here. So now you can easily tap on this skip option to skip from this page. Now you want to stuck anywhere. Now it's your final setup of your smartphone. If you want to use new pin pattern and password lock, you can use from here. So I will use. Uh, new pattern lock from here go to the next confirm go to the next skip from here you will get a pop-up that you're all set up simply have to tap on this finish option now select a language from this page 
कंटिन्यू एंड फिनिश so here you can see that your samsung android smartphone has been completely unlocked pin pattern and password has been removed and the main thing is that your phone's frp lock also removed from this method so if this video helped you to bypass your frp lock of your samsung android smartphone then do the like this video and if you have stuck anywhere in this method then make sure of uh, use the every step very carefully uh, your phone will be completely frp bypassed with this method Okay so thank you so much see you in next videos